Yo, what is going on you guys? Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to be taking you guys through Hero as a bossing mule post ignition. I'm going to be taking you guys through the nodes, the bossing, how to boss with this class now, training, and everything in between. I know I sound like a broken record, but about 85% of you guys are not subscribed to the channel, so if you could, please consider subscribing. It is completely free and it helps out a ton. Anyways, let's get right into the video. Hero is actually a really good bossing mule. I love this class i think it is so fun to play especially now that it's a two minute class feels like you can burst every single boss which is absolutely amazing this class does so much damage now especially as a bossy mule i highly highly recommend this class and obviously we're gonna get into a couple of things why i do recommend this class so i actually do not have the trios which is really surprising that this boss is doing all the bosses as fast as it is with missing trios so the trios are as followed you want raging blow cry valhalla and final attack final damage you only need one trio on a bossing mill for hero which again makes this class so good the lower amount of nodes you need the better the bossing mill in my opinion and then the skills you want to prioritize maxing first are burning soul blade and instinctual combo i would max them at the same speed but instinctual combo i think is more important than burning soul blade one thing to keep in mind the higher level that burning soul blade is the higher uptime it does have so that is a plus to maxing burning soul blade other nodes that you're gonna need in your v matrix are decent speed infusion decent sharp eyes world reaver urda nova sword illusion and that's pretty much it and maple goddess blessing now i kind of want to get into the equips to show you guys what we're working with this class is funded but it's not as funded as it looks i am using a one-handed sword which some people would say isn't the most optimal but i think as a bossing mill you can definitely get away with using a one-handed sword the reason why using a one-handed compared to a two-handed is better in my opinion is you don't have have to roll for plus one attack speed which on a bossing mule i don't think rolling for plus one attack speed on your inner ability is ever worth it to be honest it just takes way too much money so this class is sitting at around 12k and it is missing two rings so keep that in mind i just really like the bossing on this class like it just feels like you're constantly bursting before on hero it felt kind of boring because you were waiting four minutes to burst you're just doing no damage now that you're bursting every two minutes it just feels so much more enjoyable if you guys are curious on how to properly burst i'm gonna go through what i do but obviously if you want to be most efficient you should ask a hero main what i do when i'm bursting is i press maple goddess blessing epic adventure burning soul blade cry valhalla then i will bind use a b link sword illusion and then press instinctual combo and then pretty much just hold down raging blow so if you guys are unfamiliar with this class instinctual combo used to be 30 seconds so you just do a ton of damage like that was your burst you were bursting for 30 seconds but now it's only a 15 second burst which i think makes it really really good for a bossing move because in the bind you're getting all that damage in the 15 seconds you get that whole a b link in two minutes you're back to bursting some quick tips and tricks that maybe some people don't know about hero is burning soul blade actually is a summon so you'll click it to activate it if you click it again it'll actually place down the blade as a summon and do damage this is what you should be doing when you're bossing as for the training with hero i actually really enjoy training on this class pretty much all you do is just spam raging blow you jump around the map it pretty much hits all platforms it's really really good and now burning soul blade you can place that down on the map you get an extra summon and then honestly paired with urda nova you might just be clearing the entire map with summons all around i think hero is honestly in the s tier of bossing mills now it's just an all around picture perfect bosser this is exactly what you want you want a two minute class you want to be bursting all the time you want the training to be good you want the class to be pretty simple which i think hero is you just press all your buffs and then hold down raging blow it's really fun really good and if you are someone who enjoys playing a class that just spits out a bunch of lines in a small period of time this is definitely the class for you a few other tips that maybe some people don't know about cry valhalla actually gives you 30 percent critical rate and it is a super sense so while this skill is active you will be in super sense the entire time so this is really good for lotus akechi any boss that does a push attack this is extremely useful so keep that in mind if you guys didn't know hero actually does have have an iframe as well it is called world reaver and it does help out quite a bit for example in lotus you can press your iframe and then dash through the lasers to the other side it's actually really helpful 
Another thing that you might not know about Hero is Sword Illusion actually does give a buff now. And as for the movement on Hero, surprisingly, it's really good. It does have an up jump, a down jump, and a dash. Upward charge is the up jump, and then leap attack is the down jump. It's really useful, and actually the movement feels really nice on Hero. Anyways, overall, I would rank Hero as a S tier bossing meal. This is really good, it's super fun to play, and I had an absolute blast bossing, training, and overall just playing this class. If you guys do play Hero, please please leave some comments down below if you guys like this class if you don't like this class if you have any other tips and tricks i'd love to hear it if you did enjoy today's video go down hit that subscribe button it is completely free anyways as always i hope you guys have a fantastic day and i'll see you guys in the next one peace